The content you are about to watch is not intended for children. Viewer discretion advised. Ah, <sighs> here we are once again. It's more B Week, where we enjoy fan fictions from the B Movie, the annual event here on the Regretful Reads channel. Welcome, Regretters. Before we get started, there is a P.O. box that I have now in the description. Uh, I've gotten a lot of things in the mail. A lot of things. Some good, some bad. Lots of not safe for work things. But they are packaged in very discreet packaging, so. Anyway, without further ado, let's get on to our next B story. This one concerns Shrek and Barry. Someone had mentioned in the comments about, oh, I wonder if there's a Shrek and Barry fanfiction. Well, of course there is! Anyway, this story is entitled Forbidden Love by Cinnamon Knee. Chapter 1. A Swampy Meeting. Buzz, 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 crash! Barry groaned as he stood up from his crash of a landing looking up to find a not-so-welcoming swamp in front of him. He hastily stumbled away from the teleportation device he had used to get here. Where am I? he thought to himself. Barry staggered into the swamp, breathing heavily. He weakly knocked on the largest door, which was covered in mold and slime. Barry made a face just as the door swung open to reveal a huge green ogre. Who are you, Basil? The ogre said with a heavy accent. As Barry flew closer, his tear-stained cheeks became more visible. What's wrong? I'm Barry, by the way, said the bee, barging into his home. Barry sat at the table with dead rats scattered across it. I'm Shrek. My wife died of cancer. Her name was Fiona, Shrek murmured, sitting down across from Barry. Oh, Barry sputtered. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, God. Shrek sighed, taking an ogre-sized bite out of his dead rat, which was basically the whole thing. He chomped it down, juices sprang all over Barry. Gulping it harshly, he murmured, I miss her. Barry bit his lip. I bet you need a little... Distraction. <laughs> he whispered. Taking a step toward Shrek, he traced Shrek's collarbone, seductively winking at him. Shrek's breath hitched in his throat as he blushed furiously. B Barry, I'm... I'm straight. No, you're not, whispered Barry, now sitting on his lap. I'm gonna turn you by Shrek-sual. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Barry leaned in and kissed Shrek passionately as Shrek's big ogre hands traveled down Barry's body, touching every spot. Just as things were getting heated, Shrek whispered, It's all ogre now. What was that, baby? Asked Barry, who had taken off his sweater and was now nibbling on Shrek's flabby neck. I said, Shrek started, standing up and grabbing Barry by the throat. It's all ogre now! Shrek used his huge yellow teeth to rip Barry open from head to toe, Barry screamed, a blood-curdling scream, as he died in Shrek's arms. Shrek threw him in the air and drop-kicked his cold, lifeless body out the window. Stay out of me, swamp, muttered Shreky sexily as he turned his head to go eat more rats. The end. Wow, what a twist there at the end. Fun stuff here on B Week, everybody. If you'd like to support the channel, go on patreon.com slash regretfulreads, or you can become a member. I'll see you next time here on the Regretful Reads channel, 
where we continue. Be weak. Take care, everybody. Bye-bye.